Hey guys, before we get started with today's video, one, I know I look a little crazy and I have so much makeup on. It is uh, Halloween. So I'm getting ready to go for Halloween. I'm being low red riding hood. Let me know in the comments below what you guys are being for Halloween. So before I get started with today's video, I'm home from a trip. The last thing I feel like doing is running to the grocery store and picking up all these groceries and trying to figure out what I want to cook. So that is why I love to use HelloFresh. They deliver everything straight to my door and they have such a variety of meals to cook. Let me show you guys what three meals I got for this week. So the first one I got is this delicious Tuscan sausage and pepper spaghetti. It doesn't that look really good. And then this is the butternut squash agnelotti. That's probably so wrong how you say it. But then the one I'm making for Chance and I tonight is the chicken tacos. How good does that look? So this is really easy. I am not someone who knows how to cook, but it gives you all the ingredients and it gives you step-by-step -step instructions. So everything that you need for each meal comes in a little bag like this and I have it all laid out here. So all of the HelloFresh meals usually can be made within 30 minutes and it does say it on the back of these cards. Like HelloFresh is now $6.99 per serving and it's America's number one meal kit. I just know it's easy. My mom loved it when I would do this at home because you don't have to go to the store and pick out every single ingredient, especially if you have time constraints. Like, when I get home, I just want this to be delivered to my door. And sometimes I'm only home for like two days at a time and I don't have time to go grocery shopping. I'm gonna make this for dinner for us. Let's see how good it is. Let's see, I've never cooked for Chance. I'm so excited, because this is like a really big treat for me. <laughs> and so let's see if I'm a good cook. You will be, you'll be great. Guys, it's looking really good. This is glamour cooking. This is glamorous. Sweatpants and all. Sweatpants. Ooh, look at those feety. <laughs> <laughs> you know there's so many people in sweatpants. Ew. Not me. No, I know. You know what? You can't even smell that yummy candle because of all this cooking. It's the ambiance. Oh my gosh, just call me footage guru. This is looking yummy. Yummy! How good does that look? I'm gonna put some salt and pepper on. And then I know Chance will want... Chance, you like sriracha, right? Oh yeah! Alright, I'm gonna put sriracha on his and a little sour cream. Okay, Gosh. let's see what Here you think is. As, with your one red painted. <laughs> it's just a, it's a location indicator, it just lets you know I'm here. It's <laughs> actually really good. Oh my god. Okay guys, if you're interested in trying out HelloFresh, you can get six meals free. That's two free meals per for the first three boxes that you get. You can go to HelloFresh.com and enter promo code CARRIEAN60 to get $60 off your order. So thank you so much to HelloFresh for collaborating with me on this video. And now let's get right into the rest of the vlog. Okay guys, I just got the best call from crew scheduling. I literally screamed on the phone with her, and I think I might have said the word shit. Like, I need to stop saying this, but I'm going to Barcelona. This is my first international. Oh my gosh. I don't even know what to pack. What is Barcelona like? What do I wear? Oh my gosh. How long is this flight? <sighs> wow. Okay, so, obviously, not prepared for this. Uh, I just started getting ready. Oh my god, I've never been to Barcelona. And it was a really short call because she usually I have to check in downstairs in the crew room, but she's waving my check in and I can just call her when I get to the airport. So they didn't even give me two hours. Which is awesome. But oh my god, I'm going to Barcelona. What? This is wild. Okay. 
I have so much to do. I don't even know if I should, I can probably not even bring food. Oh, I bet they have crew meals. Cause this is a long flight. Holy cow, go to Barcelona. I am the H flight attendant. Not really sure what that means. This plane is so big. Okay, let's see if I know anyone. Probably, oh my gosh, there's people with three digits on here. Seniority. That means it's senior AF, guys. Well packed, I'm ready to go. I overpacked because I have no idea what people wear in Barcelona. <coughs> I'm sick, but I'm still going. And I'm excited. Are you guys excited? Oh my gosh, I'm like freaking out. Uh, yeah, I hope this is a nice crew. I know it's gonna be a really senior crew. That's okay. I'm just so excited to get there. This is gonna be amazing, 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 amazing. So yeah, are you guys ready for this? I'm ready for this. Let's do this thing. We're in Barcelona. I'm gonna show you the view real quick before I have to head downstairs. Maybe I'll show you the view. Yes, I will. Okay. I will tell you all about the flight when I get back, but I'm running late. Surprise, surprise. Um, it is so gloomy out here in Barcelona today. It was raining and now it's not. But I am going to meet up with a crew member and we're going to go walk around. It was a long day. So I just took a nap because I needed one. I had to run to the doctor and get something for my ear because it's clogged because I'm sick and I shouldn't have been flying when I'm sick. So one of the stories, don't fly if you're sick. It's really bad for you. But I will show you guys the room and everything when we get back. But now let's go sightseeing in Barcelona. I must have left it sitting right there. But it was a cheap umbrella. Okay, as long as it wasn't like a really nice one. <laughs> Now you did, so you can buy a new one. Is this where we want to go? Yeah. What is all this? Oh, you know. Oh, you're not allowed. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Thank you. That's cool. Jennifer tried to come down here alone. Yeah. She's already been, uh, oh. used the train and stuff before. So I think she feels pretty comfortable. Or she'll just take an Uber. Yeah. By the who? Thank you. All right, I Does he only get paid off of tips? Yep.
jumped over that thing. I was like, oh, okay. I hope I'm not a sissy with that. Jumped over what? Over that thing they didn't even pay. They just jumped. Oh. Huh. I am. I just been dumped. I did. so happy hey guys so I just got back from our adventure in Barcelona and I cannot tell you guys how much fun we had we had a blast um, last time I checked in with you I was literally running out the door and we as you guys saw in those clips we took the train and we went out to this little shopping area, but we had so much fun. We walked around everywhere. We went shopping. We had dinner. We just explored. It was a blast. Um, so we did that all day long, and I went with one, two, four other crew members. So there was kind of a big group of us, and it was just a blast. I couldn't have asked for a better first international trip because sometimes when you go on these international trips you get women who women and men who have been here for a long who have been with the company for a long time and sometimes they don't want to go out or they don't want to explore because they've seen everything you know so I got really really lucky with the group that I did and a girl that I've actually worked with before on my first trip to um, New Orleans was on it. So when I walked on the plane and I saw her, I literally ran up and hugged her. And I was so excited because I was like, oh, I was really nervous. First trip, um, I wasn't totally nervous, but I was kind of like, what am I getting myself into? And when I saw her, I just like felt completely at ease and I was just so happy. Um, but I'm heading to bed. I will talk to you guys more about this in the morning. I'll show you the room. The lighting in here is just so bad. I can't even right now. So I will show you guys more in the morning. I'll talk to you guys more in the morning about the flight, how long it was, all the good details and everything that we did. And I'll show you what I bought today. Good stuff. So I will check with you guys in the morning. Good night. That is the coolest thing ever. Good morning. Welcome to my little room here in Barcelona. It is a complete disaster, but I thought I would show it to you anyway. Can you look at the size of this mirror? How cool is this? Behind it is like a hidden closet. It's not neat. So then over here, this is how I turn on the lights. If someone didn't tell me, I probably would have been really confused. You just put your key card in there, you turn on. How neat is that? So we come over this way, we have the bathroom, the shower with an amazing shower head. Oh my gosh, it was beautiful. And then over here we have the very modern sink, towels, huge water bottles. That's not from here, that's from the plane. 
and the room. So guys, yesterday it was a blast. We did so many fun things. We walked around, we ate, we shopped. So I thought I would do a little um, haul for you guys real quick before I head downstairs to get breakfast with the girls. Okay, so I'm in my pajamas right now, but I would show you real quick what I got. So around here, they have pharmacies on like every single corner. It's crazy. Um, and you just go in, you tell them what you need, and they kind of just give it to you. It's the craziest thing. You don't need to go see a doctor. You don't really need a prescription for anything. I got some skincare stuff um, for me, my mom, my aunts, all of us. The first thing I got is by La Roche-Posay. La Roche-Posay? I have no idea. Um, and this is just a facial cleanser for acne because I've been breaking out a little bit in here from flying. And then from the same brand, I got a spot treatment um, corrector especifico. Um, just got that. My Spanish is horrible. Like, I'm telling you, I took enough Spanish in college, you'd think I would know what I'm saying. She gave me a mini travel one complimentary and this zero zinc facial spray and then i heard that this cream was amazing for multiple flight attendants that i was with so i bought six of them <laughs> one for me and one for all of my aunts and this is just for your face neck and cleavage skin care so it just basically is for like anti-wrinkle kind of just tightens everything and this is what it looks like so if you are ever here i hear that this is amazing and we went to like six pharmacies and they were all sold out so the last one that we hit which was right by our hotel had 200 so i grabbed a bunch of those and the next place that we went was a makeup store called kiko milano and um one of the flight attendants swears by this eyeliner so i was like okay i'll give it a try and so we went in here and we were in there for like 30 minutes we had so much fun just trying stuff on and playing with it um and so it was buy to get two free so i bought a bunch of eyeliners for my mom and i um, and the brain or the type of eyeliner is the intense color long lasting eyeliner just looks like that and we got ours in the shade 05 yeah 05 and it's just like this purpley plum color which is really good if you have green eyes and my mom and i both have green eyes so um this stuff is bulletproof their primer which she said that people literally buy five of every single time they come in so i was like you know you have one more it's mine and this is just like a skin blurring primer for all skin types um just looks like that and i've never heard of this brand have you guys heard of it and then this was their best seller from the brand and it's the dark treasure mascara i use it today i'm not really sure what i think of it quite yet but i said hey why not and everything here is pretty inexpensive it's amazing so those are all the products that I got. Um, I wanted to get more like touristy things, like bring back shirts and I don't know, little knickknacks for my nephews, but there really wasn't anything that caught my eye that much. And that's hard to do because I'm a professional shopper. So you think anything would have caught my eye, but it really didn't. Um, but yeah, we had so much fun. I'm gonna give you guys a few tips if you ever do come to Barcelona though. Do not forget a universal charger because their wall outlets are not the same as in America. I'm required to carry a universal charger, but if you've never been here, then you probably would think to do that. Um, so there's that. They do have Uber here, um, but taking the public train is kind of fun. You kind of get more of a the experience. Be careful for pickpocketing we didn't have any issues but i was reading online and a lot of people said that they have had issues so be careful of that and yeah just have fun explore um 
I looked up a lot of the touristy things to do and the number one thing to do was to go see this grand church but I heard that it's just so many lines there and I don't really want to be waiting in line when I only have one day here in Barcelona so I skipped that so I didn't really want to do that I wanted to do something where I could explore and just see the area it was amazing the wine if you know Spanish touch up on your Spanish because that will help I wish I would have touched up on my Spanish. So yeah, those are my tips for you guys. Just have fun. And if you get the chance to come here, definitely do it. Um, it was a great time. And the flight here from, we went directly from Philly to Barcelona and it was only eight hours. Which I know it sounds like a long time, but it went by so fast. So I'm gonna head downstairs, get some breakfast. I'll take we saw All of it. <laughs> Alright guys, I'm all dressed and ready to go. I really don't want to leave, but I cannot wait to come back here and explore more. I forgot to mention, if you guys do come here, I definitely recommend going to the beach. I hear it's amazing. And, oh my god, just look at that view. I don't want to go if I don't get a chance to say goodbye to you guys when I get home because we we all know how I've been lately like once I get home all I do is sleep and I forget to sign off and it's just a mess so I figure I'll say goodbye here and if I get a chance to insert some clips then I do if I don't I don't um but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog to Barcelona and I think I'm gonna try and pick up some more international trips more usually I'm just like you know Whatever comes to me comes to me. I'm not like gonna be too aggressive about it and try super hard. Like I know I'll get international eventually. Um, but I think I might start being a little bit more aggressive. Hopefully we have some more of these trips coming up soon. So I thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that my sick voice did not annoy you too much. I'm sorry if it did. And I'll see you guys in my next vlog. Bye.